Fighting is an individual sport, it are two people against each other, but it's not like there's, like with tennis, there's a net between it. You're really fighting against each other. And, and that is like, that creates a certain synergy you, can, you cannot find in any other sport. Actually, it was like, I read the biography of Henry Agassi, and he said like, when I was playing tennis, and I believe his father was a boxer, and uh, his father compared boxing a lot to tennis. It's like, uh, I said, when I uh, walked onto the center court, I felt so lonely always. And I, I could, uh, I always understand how a boxer should feel uh, like, so lonely, uh, like I felt on the center court as well. And, um, and, and, and that's the beauty of it, because you're so lonely. Of course, you're there with your team and with your coach and everything. But you know, you're standing there, you don't see the crowd, you only see lights and it, you have to do it at that point. And that, that creates such a, um, a pressure on you, but it's a positive pressure for me, that you can achieve stuff you would never dreamed of. And that's why the, that's also like a beauty of the sport. And if you, if you lose, like I lost my last fight, you know, you, <laughs> you have to suck it up too. And, and it's like this high-risk game effect, and that's what I like so much about it. And you cannot find it in any other sport. I forgot my mouthpiece. It was eight months ago, and it was Janet flew to Kansas. I, I stayed there after my fight with Misha, and um, she wanted to sign me for a black eye. And then uh, Janet uh, teamed up with Shannon Epp. She worked for every company in the business, she knows so much about everything and this is the point that whatever she, she, she sucked up and took in, she can now put it in one thing and in one promotion yeah. and build it really big and I really believe in that, she's got everything uh, what it takes and Jenna brings in so much uh, passion and energy. So I, I met her like, when I met her I was like, okay this woman, she's legit, you know, she really cares about women in MMA. And uh, to, they are together this very powerful, strong uh, like couple. Martin is like MacGyvering uh, a mouthpiece for me. <laughs> I think it's really good to have a female, all female organization, so people can really focus on the females. We have a different tone of voice in marketing as well. If you look at the UFC, you will see like uh, Harley Davidson, and it's very m masculine. And uh, what I think is the beauty in, in, in Victa, it's about athleticism of, of women. And all the women who are watching uh, our shows can see that you can be a normal girl, or women or whatever, and uh, you can still kick ass. And that's important, you know? They will, I hope we can inspire so many uh, women that it's not only one girl fight, no, it is a full card of women who kick ass. And I believe that will will uh, create such a buzz and energy and a lot of empowerment for women who watch it. But it's also entertaining for men, of course, you know, for obvious reasons. But um, yeah, I think uh, Invicta has it all. Yeah, it's hard. We didn't get so much fight, so uh, the, money's, uh, <laughs> the money's gone. We have to make a new uh, <laughs> and a cheap way to find... Uh, <laughs> we have to find a cheap way to make mouthpieces, so yeah. <laughs> Again. <laughs> <laughs> I fought against Liz Camus at 135 and she gave me a hell of a fight. And she's on the card as well, so I'm really looking forward to that fight. She's still fighting at 135, I'm fighting at 145 now. And there's a big difference in my uh, energy now. I really feel so much stronger now. And uh, yeah, that, that's a fight I really want to see. And uh, there's some other girls. Uh, fighting at 145 as well and Invicta also has this um, uh, they work together with Strike Force so I believe more girls of 145 of Strike Force will go come to Invicta. Tell me when I fought her the first time it was in Swiss and uh, I kicked her down pretty easy and then she jumped I believe into me in the guard and we fell on the ground and then she dominated me on the ground for a long time but like 10 seconds uh, Prior to the end of the fight, I made her tap. I think people should definitely come to my fight. I mean, it's like it's the first time I'm fighting at 145 again. I've got my power back. I really, really, really want to fight. I want to show the people that, you know, I'm not the... When I strike, I strike hard. People will not walk through my punches anymore because I have my power back. It's all female card. It's unique. It's the first time it's, it's at this scale that 
women are fighting. It are the best. It's like Liz Camus is fighting as well. I'm fighting. It's, it's a great card. People should come out, should support us, and, and just have a good evening out.